we put out this episode uh, in this in in our fantastic award winning Newsbeat podcast. Can't pull up the music, but yeah. please let them know exactly how we incorporate this after we've spoken to uh, Alan Newton, who was a, an exoneree uh, out in uh, uh, New York City. Uh, great guy, told us his story. Um, and then we talked to Rebecca Brown, who was the director of policy at the Innocence Project, told us how what they're doing behind the scenes to try to free folks. And then we said, man, I know, and you know, and people listening know just how visceral and compelling our rap artists are when they tell us a story and they give it to us raw and they get inside our, our you know, feelings and they touch us in a way that ju- even hearing Alan Newton, like almost crying and like that gets to us too. But when it's, when it's done poetically, it's another thing. If you would, sir, I, I yield the floor. Hmm. Lying down with my wife and child, tired, been a long night, but now I'm chilling, happy, full, built a nice little life, I'm proud. Bell ringing, it's late though, door knocking, it's straight though, y'all stay here, I'ma get it. Probably somebody got locked out their place, you know? Fast forward this whirlwind, now I'm hurled into a cell, got my girl flipping as well, my whole world slipping, no bell. Feel like I'm sitting right on the third rail, how the hell they really gonna think I got it in me? I ain't never heard a damn soul, God forgive me. Plus I got four witnesses, I mean, really? Cause of my prior, cause of my skin? Told you I'm tired, you ask me again. Tell me again, repeat it, repeat it. If I wanna see my family, I just eat it. Guess I just plead it, cause so far this pleading ain't making no difference, I feel so defeated. How is this real, yo, how is this legal? Why does it feel so, walls closing in? I know my family and friends know the deal. None of that matters if we being real. I hope my family and friends know the deal. If we gonna fight this, if we gonna appeal. Tired, confused, yeah, I signed a confession, but I ain't never fired that weapon. And I ain't never touched that girl, that's a lie. I would die first, not even a question. 